Mike Kuhn back at the pit in Albuquerque. The Illini win an exciting one uh, today, 68-67 over Wichita State. Joining us now, Illini head coach Nancy Fay, and we don't lack for excitement here in Illinois basketball <laughs> uh, in your first year. Well, I thought we had a really good start. Uh, I would say that little third quarter lapse, and um, and I think we're going to have to work on some uh, like late game, getting the ball and stuff. That kind of hurt us at the end, but bottom line, we won. Well, let's talk about the performance of Allie Andrews. Uh, not only did she have the, what turned out to be the game-winning free throws, but a career-high six uh, three-pointers, 26 points. Talk about her performance offensively. You know, uh, I just talked to her, and I said, hey, what happened with those two shots you missed? Um, it, was a, <laughs> it was a pretty, I mean, well, honestly, at times it were, they were quiet to me. You know, you didn't really, I didn't realize it. I, at one point, you know, she was, I knew she was knocking out shots, tried to give her the ball a few times. But a lot of those were hers, you know, um, hustle points. Uh, and, uh, you know, there's a lapse. She had crashed a couple times. You don't have to say much to her twice, and she did a good job. Great job. Well, you've had several games in which the opponent continues to make run after run. I think they're used to it. And uh, talk about how the team responded after some adversity there in the fourth quarter. Well, that's what I told them at halftime. I mean, we're not the only ones that are competitors in this building. I mean, we're up by 10 and a half, I believe, and I think that we have to understand people compete, and, it, and we have to – there's going to be runs – uh, I wasn't really, it took us a while to bounce back, but we did. Talk about the uh, the two defensive plays at the end, because I thought you had them defended well. The lob into Bassard, didn't, you know, they got the ball back, and then uh, that last play, and no uh, bigger rebounds in the ball game. This one of the smallest players on the floor, Jalen Kirkpatrick, uh, had two critical late rebounds. Uh, maybe we'll get to her in a second, but just talk about uh, defending those last two plays. Well, you know, I, th I think uh, Coach Malone did a great job on the scout. We knew a lot of what they were going to do. I felt, um, we, you know, we weren't sure if it was going to be a pull up or if it was going to go inside. I thought we had the inside covered uh, pretty well because that's they're pretty strong inside. So uh, and like you said, you know, those are they had a wide open little 15 footer. It's it's part of the game. Sometimes they go in and I've been on the other end of that, too. And Jalen had the presence not only to get the rebound, but to dribble it across the timeline <laughs> and uh, in the ball game that way. Well, you know, and we talked to her. I mean, she had missed a couple three thro free throws at the end. And I said that, too. I said, you had the two biggest rebounds and the smallest person on the court. And I said, I never saw her dribble so fast in my life. <laughs> and she says, Coach, I didn't want to get fouled. <laughs> <laughs> well, and a lot of other players have stepped up. Uh, Kennedy Catton had had 10 points again today. Alex, seven points, was in foul trouble. We knew that uh, Bassard was going to be a load, and uh, she was tough to defend. Well, and I, and I think that's what starts when you start developing other places to go to. If you're stopping two of our players, you know, that's going to be a pretty easy scout. So when things happen or people get in foul trouble or people aren't able to play, other people step up, and I, that's a good thing for us. I, of course, would love to have her out there all the time. Well, once again, we love the energy. We love the competitiveness of this team. You're building something here, I think, and 5-2 uh, and two in the year going into a, what will be another tough game tomorrow. It's going to be a real tough game. Uh, they do a lot of things right, um, but, you know, we're here to compete. Well, take uh, 30 minutes or so to celebrate and uh, get back uh, to the grind, getting ready for uh, another big game tomorrow. Thanks for joining us. We will do that.